Hey guys, welcome to another episode of Crafting with EB. I am EB. So I decided to do some artwork with my Zen Pop box that I got in September. I decided when I was looking at all these little characters to draw a little tea party. Now I'm looking at the finished art now. I noticed that I forgot some things, but I think it's going to be fun. So I'm using some watercolor brush pens that I got a while back to create this art. And I'm also using a Art King Art um, flat brush in size 6. So I'm using Drawn Out Kirby there. I drew this actually off screen. So you have Pikachu, Kirby... Uh, a kitty cat and then a teddy bear which the teddy bear and the kitty cat and all these creatures came in the box um, and stuff so I thought it would be very cute to draw like a little tea party them all together and I kind of went kind of creative and tried to not take too long to draw these but I thought they were very cute I loved how it turned out I hope you did too. If you did, uh, give me that big old thumbs up. I did. I seen drawn with waffles create stuff when she gets her zen box. So I kind of wanted to do the same thing, just to stretch my little art muscle out just a little bit. I thought that would be kind of fun to do and create something out of stationary that you might not so down at the bottom of that picture you'll see a blue tape now this was the washi tape that came in and yes this is how long the design is on that part of the washi tape and i thought it was super cute i love pikachu <laughs> i like kirby as well so I just thought it was super cute that I got this in the box. I thought it was super cute. Now, I did use, and I did notice that there's this piece of, in there, that's actually an eraser. And then on the other side, it's like kind of like a vacuum that will suck up all your eraser shavings, which I thought was actually kind of cool. And there is a ruler in there with Kirby on there. So that is where I got Kirby from. Oh my god. I loved growing up, you know. And you get to see all these animes. I'm actually getting into more animes now. I watched uh, My Neighbor Totoro. Uh, it was actually the most cutest little thing. So I might do something with that coming up. There's that famous scene where they're all standing in the in the rain and tutorial is there helping the girls cope with their mom being in the hospital so i thought that was very it's a very cute movie um i want to see kiki's delivery service uh there's a list that i got but i thought these were very cute i love the cat stickers i love how it's mostly cat butts <laughs> You can see it there kind of off screen. And I did want to use at least the markers that came with there. There's two colors, a uh, dark green and a blue. I do use those towards the end in order to make sure I kind of use most of the stuff. But I, I, I do like these boxes. I think they're unique. Uh, I love how Japan actually packaged their stuff and... It's something unique and most people don't really see. I did like how the kitty turned out, but not when I, I didn't like his mouth, but I liked how his body shape was. And I'm actually going to try. I seen somebody post their Inktober list prompts of nothing but cats. I might try to dabble in. Cats are not my strongest drawings, but, you know, hey, you got to get stronger as an artist. Oh, let's give it a go. So, I plan on trying it out. 
I wanted these to be more like a stuffed animal and the little girl's not in the screen or in the area or she had to go somewhere and the cat the and the her stuffed animals are just waiting for her to come back to finish the tea party yes i did cut my video down a lot so <laughs> just to try to make it make it look a little more better than you know you dealing with a long video i i try not to make my videos too long but i do like to include most of my stuff that i did draw i did like how i did pikachu's eyes i thought that was very cool actually this is my first time drawing pikachu i think i did pretty well leave me a comment of what is your favorite pokemon mine is actually the pony one the with the fire i think his name is poyo i think that's how you say it i'm sorry if i butcher names <laughs> but i did find this pace kind of relaxing and kind of like okay let's do something you might not normally do so I normally don't draw stuff like this so it's actually kind of kind of relaxing kind of nice to not be you know what i mean so much like oh here's a prompt go ahead and draw and do something but i do plan to participate in inktober so i do have more videos coming and i'm going to try to do inktober every single day i already have all my drawings pre-drawn out so when you see it i'm actually just inking the piece if you are a participant in inktober do it for yourself don't do it for what's going on do it to help yourself out that's what i plan on doing and that's why when i bought those two other sketchbooks i plan on using those to make myself better try to do other inktobers try to inspire myself to do better so as you can see i'm using i use both ends of each pen to try to do something with them i actually do like how i just made it simple on the teacups and on the tea kettle itself and i did draw a little thing of sugar and creamer down there um i forgot the color in their drinks but yeah, we'll just say they're drinking water because she's the child isn't allowed to have flavored drinks in their room so that's my story and i'm sticking to it <laughs> but i hope you did enjoy this drawing um it's not really one of my best but you know what i mean i kind of when i started using these the uh, the pens i kind of was like regretting my choice of art supply to draw but i did use my micron pn pen to do my fine liner with it but i did use the like a gray a brown a darker brown uh the black the pink light pink and then the dark pink and then the yellow and the red to, and then I used the blue to make the rug just so it looks like oh they're sitting somewhere and they're just it, I think it kind of turned out okay the rug part so yeah there's me trying to doodle the rug so I'm gonna let you enjoy the rest of the video I like to thank you very much for watching my video if you like this video give me a big old thumbs up I do have another Zen pop box coming it is the October box. I can't wait to get it. So I will see you in the next video. And I would like to, again, I like to thank you for watching. And I would like to thank you if you decide to subscribe to my channel. I do lots of unboxings and other art. So have a wonderful day. Enjoy the rest of the video and take care of yourself and be safe out there. Talk to you soon. See you in the next video. Bye guys.